Hello guys, this is OGMAN98 here. This is going to be an Inform Alert player review. He's a cam that plays for um, Rapid Vienna, I think, or, I believe. And the a Bundesliga. So now, for those who want to see, uh, this is the squad I play. Danny Alarin, uh, Rapid Vienna, yes, Austria, Austrian from the a Bundesliga. I actually play him centre forward with the inform Hoshinair up front. Beast of a player, second in form, cost me 40k. And Danny Alar cost me 17k, so a massive price difference between those two. But I would say Hoshinair is better than Alar, but Alar is still a good player, so he's worth the buy for 17k. And also playing Klein at right back and. Um, Vrishik in centre mid, he is the only non Austrian in this squad guys, so now uh, we'll move on to Denny Atlar's in game stats. So guys, as you can see on screen now, there is Rene uh, Allah's Rene Denny Allah's in game stats. Seventy four ball control, sixty three crossing, the crossing is an absolute why because I think I've got a couple of corners in the clips coming up and you watch his crossing. Absolutely magnificent. And then 69 curve, also a lie, I'd say. I think I'd say he's about got 80 odd curve, as you'll see in the corners that I've got. And the clips coming up. 74 dribbling, 78 finishing, 78 free kick accuracy. It's not the best at free kicks, I've hot a few, but they're not that great. 63 heading accuracy, I think I've scored a couple of headers on him, so that's not that bad. Pretty poor, 53 long pass, you can see that in game. 82 long shots, not bad, but uh, I don't think his long shots are amazing. I'd say they're about 70s, not 80s, but anyway, 72 penalties, I don't think I do get a penalty with him in this gameplay coming up, but anyway, we'll see. Shot power 85 and volley 72. He's 6 foot 1, he's left footed, medium attacking work great, medium defensive work great. I actually think he'd be better in a CM than a centre forward, but I'm playing him in a cam. I might try him in CM in a different date. Three star weak route and three star skills, enough to do their away, so I'm happy with that. 70 acceleration, 83 agility, 66 balance, 75 jumping, 74 reactions, 70, no, 81 sprint speed, 96 stamina and 67 strength. He is quite, quite fast, I'd say 81's a high, I'd say about 83 maybe, but it takes a while to get into his stride obviously if he's poor acceleration. Then he's got 69 aggression, 28 interceptions, 67 attacking position and pretty poor mental attributes there guys. So now we'll go into the clips. So, lads, here are some of the goals I managed to get with Denny Alar. Now, his long shot is just absolutely amazing. It says 82, but oh my god, it's w much better than that. As you'll see in some of the cuts coming up, he has got some beast long shots with him. And his dribbling's really good as well. The ball just got to his feet when he's doing like roulettes and just turning in and out players also. Uh, in my overall opinion, I think Den Allard is definitely worth 17k, so he's obviously the best Austrian cam, I think he's better than Genovic or whatever he's called to play for um, Wender Bremen I think, because when I played with him I just didn't rate him highly at all, I don't think he's good. So I think you're better off going for Allard, so he's, Allard's only about 5k dear than him on the Xbox, I'm not sure about PS3 prices, but... Allard is definitely the best captain in the A Bundesliga anyway. He's a fantastic player with great shooting ability and he can come up with a few headers. I think I do get a few headers in these clips and I got a brilliant free kick as well with him. So his dribbling is just outstanding. So is his, shot, uh, his long shots and shot power. The only thing I would say is maybe a bit of pace because I think it's 81 sprint speed. He does take quite a while to get in his stride with 78 acceleration so it's pretty, pretty poor with that but... Even at that still, if you like moving in and out, dribbling, passing and moving, like you'd love him, Danny Alarm in FIFA, but <coughs> definitely not the fastest player. He's like just one of those players that if you get it on his left foot, it's just going to have a good cross, a good shot, a good pass, anything like that. So I do definitely re recommend him, and I recommend this team, guys, that, that you saw at the start with Inform Hoisner, I think. Here coming up, here's a good goal, take it from my own half. Um, Inform Hoisner. Uh, he's also a good player to play with Daniel R. So Daniel R is probably the best silver centre forward I have used in this game so far. So anyway guys, thanks for watching this Daniel R player review and please like the video and subscribe if you would like more silver player reviews. Leave you with an overhead kick at the end there. So thanks for watching and goodbye.